Hi, so today's day 19 of the 30 day challenge and today's topic is random acts of kindness. So to give you a little personal story about a random act of kindness, um, I a couple of years ago I was heading to work and I needed to fill up with fuel and put some water in my car. I was feeling or wasn't feeling the best. Um, I was quite down at the time and um, I pulled in and I filled my car up and then I went in to pay and there was this man in front of me, um, looked a bit under the weather, you know, sort of unshaven and, and not the best dressed and he was talking to the attendant and he was saying, um, oh, is there any way that um, I can get fuel, you know, that you can be fuel um, I can't pay for it, but, you know, is there any way that I can get some fuel because I need to get to my sister's, all my things in my car, I've got nothing um, and I can't pay. And I'm kind of standing there thinking, oh, I'm running late for work, I hope he doesn't take too long. Anyway, I, I listened to his story and that and the attendant said, well, no, mate, I can't do that, you know, it's not something that we can do here. I just work here. So anyway, the guy walked out looking very miserable and very sorry for himself and um, I paid for my fuel and started to head out and I passed the guy there and he was still standing at the door sort of looking bewildered and lost and um, I started to walk towards my car and I was sort of halfway across the, um, the service station and, and um, I thought, oh, hang on a minute. So I turned around and went back and I said to him, I said, look, um, where are you heading? How much fuel do you need? And he said, oh, I'm going to Brisbane. Oh, I'm going to my sister's. And I said, okay, look, pull your car around in front of one of the um, pumps and I will pay for your fuel. So he didn't say anything and, and that was fine and I walked in and I said to the guy behind the counter, I said, look, um, can you get somebody to fill that guy's car up because I'll pay for it. I said, I'll, I'll, give, I'll put $60, so give him $60 worth of fuel because it was a fairly large car so I didn't imagine that um, it would be less than 60 it would probably be more to fill it up but it certainly would have got him to Brisbane. Anyway, I went back out again and um, the attendant must have spoken to the guy out in the forecourt because the guy said to me, thank you, that was a very nice thing for you to do for this guy. And I just nodded and um, put the water in my car and um, headed off. The, the guy was just dandy. He, he was just in shock, I think. He was just so bewildered. Um, which was fine. He thanked me. He did not not thank me, but he just looked very bewildered and numb, I feel. Anyway, I drove off to work and, you know, my mood had lifted so much, so much. I felt really lighthearted and full of energy. I just felt really, really good. And it was like, well, I can do anything. Why I ever thought I could do anything? I just did it. Just that feeling was there that I'd helped somebody and I felt really, really good about it. So, and the day went really, really well at work. You know, I didn't have the usual, I would rather not be here feeling. Um, and it was great, really good. So that is my um, story about doing a random act of kindness. Now, that certainly does give you confidence. Um, it, it gives you self-worth in yourself to help somebody else and it certainly makes you feel a lot better. So that is my story for the um, random acts of kindness. So my challenge for you today is to go out and do some random act of kindness.